Hello there my fellow fans, today is Royal News. Dan Wooten has accused the Duke and Duchess of Sussex of being work shy and claimed the collapse of the couple's podcast deal with Spotify shows why spoiled royals will struggle to get by in the real world. The experts' opinions come after the Sussex's lucrative podcast deal with the streaming giant was ended by mutual agreement. Mr. Wooten shared, so while there'll always be a company stupid enough to flush millions down the loo for the initial PR of being contacted by to a deal with Harry and Meghan, the opportunity to make an impact as a game-changing content creator working with streaming giants who could bring them an audience of billions across the globe has now been dashed. It's a cautionary tale of why spoiled royals will always struggle to cut it in the real world. The Archetypes podcast ran for 12 episodes from August last year with Megan talking to celebrities, historians and experts about the history of stereotypes leveled against women. The joint statement from Archwell and Spotify said, Spotify and Archwell Audio have mutually agreed to part ways and are proud of the series we made together. But Bill Simmons, who is head of podcast innovation and monetization at Spotify, told listeners of his own podcast I wish I had been involved in the Meghan and Harry leave Spotify negotiation. Those effing grifters. That's the podcast we should have launched with them. Mr. Wooten said the saga is all catastrophic for Harry and Meghan's woke dream of living an A-list Californian lifestyle. Like that of US TV host Oprah Winfrey or Ellen DeGeneres. He claimed the Sussexes want to live such a dream without any of the toil that both those ladies put in five days a week to build their fortune. He pointed to claims from Buckingham Palace staff whom he said had allegedly Harry and Meghan were afraid of hard work. But Kevin Mayhew challenged the claim the couple were grifters, asking whether they are in fact geniuses. In a breakdown of the Sussexes' various lucrative deals, he listed £15 million from Archetypes, £81 million from Netflix and their involvement in smaller ventures in the media. Mr Mayhew estimated Harry and Meghan have managed to pull together some impressive earnings with £142,000 per minute or £8.5 million an hour. Mark Borowski, a public relations and crisis consultant, claimed the Spotify announcement would diminish what the Sussexes could receive from possible future episodes of the series. He said, Spotify and all the streamers who did very well out of lockdown are now looking hard at the costs. Their algorithms don't lie. If they were successful and they were valued by Spotify, they would still be there. He added, it shows that they don't really have anything interesting to say and more importantly, they don't have critical friends in the center of their organization. And whatever you are as a content producer, you've got to sustain it over a period of time and you need the best team around you. That is it guys, thank you for watching today's Royal News. Please like, comment and subscribe. Goodbye for now.